FCA US and the Michigan Council of Women in Technology are partnering to close the gap between girls and technology. FCA's Information and Technology Department welcomed 75 girls from five Detroit area middle schools to their Auburn Hills campus for a day of hands-on exploration of current and future automotive technology. The girls all belong to the MCWT Get It Girls after school STEM program that focuses on inspiring girls to consider careers in technology. As an IT organization, we recognize the need to get young women to continue to focus on their technical studies. We need people who have strong analytical skills, math skills, and understand data because that is so prevalent in what we do every day. We find especially in the middle school girls is sometimes that confidence isn't there and these programs give them the opportunity to build that confidence and know that they can do it. Our vision is to make Michigan the number one state for women in technology and to do that we know we need to start young with these girls and inspire and grow them into wanting to pursue IT. The people I was with, they were telling me things that could happen in 2019 or a few years from now, or maybe even flying cars. I think that it was a great opportunity because it's like women empowerment. Me and other girls, we call with each other, we help each other, and we learn more about building websites and web pages. Our objective is to tie their studies to real world. So that's what we're hoping they're taking away today. When they say, why am I learning this in school? They'll be able to say, you know what, I saw how this applied when I was at Fiat Chrysler. And I want to pursue this further in my, in my studies. One of the great things about events like these and what we do through Motor Citizens and what we do as an IT organization is giving back to the community is a significant motivator to our staff. They get as excited as the girls are. We all have a great time planning this and putting it together. And it's really fulfilling, I think, for everybody.